Shit's an Indian. Lady Liberty's headdress. I think that's probably the nicest one I've ever dug. Wow. Thimble. We're not finding industrial era junk here. No. Early abandonment. Well, hey, everybody. Welcome to a beautiful, not Thursday, in New Hampshire. Myself, Dame. We're going to do some cellar hole hunting today. This is a spot that Dame came up to uh, recently. You dug for 20 minutes and... Did a few... Uh few loops around a 20 square foot area and I found this. Check that out. This place is turned on. And then, oh, deluge. Yeah. <laughs> Bad. <laughs> Getting caught in the rain different days, different places. <laughs> <laughs> but that is summer and we'll take it. So, here we go. I'm going to turn the detectors on. Swing. It's nice and clean in here. Let's see what we can find. Well, low numbers to start out with, but you never know. Hot rock. Jeez. I haven't had one of them in a while. Just slightly higher than the the rock. Yellow tomback? Convex, cool. I've got part of suspension. A little suspender action here. Jeez, I wonder if it's lead with the numbers. If so, it's the first I've dug that style made from you know, lead, pewter, whatever. Very nice. All right, let's check Dame's target. We had uh, simultaneous targets. Yes. There's a little, uh, little convex flatty. Oh, excellent. Yeah. Excellent, yeah, and this is oh. lead or pewter. Weird. Very weird. Seems like that would be ter terribly brittle for uh, strappage, but... All right. Cool. My first target was a rock. Oh, of course. Solid 39. Love those. It's happening more and more for some reason. Like, uh, wherever we're going. Hot rocks. Yeah. There we go. The squeaky wild card. Mid-70s. Signal. Oh, bet you it's an Indian. Judging by those numbers. Yeah. There's Lady Liberty's, Lady Liberty's headdress. Well, that popped out with no problem. All right, back over to Dame. Sounds like he's got a nice tom back. This thing is so bright, I thought I had a massive silver coin. Oh my god, yeah. Look at that. Yeah, he would have been the two real range or quarter. Damn, look at, doesn't even look like you dug it. I know. <laughs> I think that's probably the nicest one I've ever dug. Wow. It doesn't even need a happy pad. <laughs> Nothing. <laughs> the stainless steel of the colonial era. Absolutely. Good job. Nice. Well, that sounds like it's on the surface, which it very well could be because of the washout. Shiny rock. That got me. That's only 55, so. See how clean the ground is from water runoff? I could be skimming buttons right now here. Oh no! 
I haven't seen one of these in a while. I think it's a tacoed dandy button. Watch it be a GW all, or something all folded over. So it actually looks like that's the shank side. Uh, later on, maybe maybe I'll unfold it. Maybe not. Clean it up really good. See what's inside. But yeah, definitely a dandy button. Seventy-six. I was ringing up. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, that's not a chirpy. That's why I came over. That's still. Yeah. It's a thing. Relics are relics. Yep. In the pouch. Sixty sixty-five. I done flung it. Beautiful button. Clean right up. Must be the rinse going over this land. Beautiful. Full shankage. Nice. All right, well I stood up, had more signal. And this is sticking out. Oh. Well, what's left of a knife blade? It's a different shape. Very cool. Very, very cool. Well, judging by the look of the actual cellar hole, it's old, but these people are here for a while, or peoples, lots of families, because we're seeing 1700s, 1800s. Lots of signals. I just came down from the side of the cellar hole, the living space, because it's it's nice down here. <laughs> Their immediate little yard, side yard, instantly signal. And another button. Just slightly convex. Bowed out, bubbled out a little bit on the face. Pull shank. But easy pickings. This is good. That's fancy. All right, so look at this. Dame got a knife too. Same thing. Different kind of shape. Yours is in better shape than mine. That is fancy. That's like a spreading knife. Exactly. Caress it. There was a little bone dust left on the handle. Yeah. Um, so, you know, 20 years ago, probably would have had the scales on it. Yeah. We are just talking and thinking that that Indian head penny may have been a transient drop because we're not finding industrial era junk here. No. And those relics, yeah, they may have been, I said 1800s earlier, but they're early 1800s, those buttons that I found. Yeah. Mostly 17, so. Yeah, I think it's, there has been no sheet metal. And once they got up into the 1830s and 40s, they were like plastered everywhere. Yeah. So. Interesting. Early abandonment. Yeah. Well, as I keep circling my way around the cellar hole, I'm back at that washed out area. 56, 57. Essentially where you guys are is where taco button came from. Yep. Didn't even need to dig it. Nice little sleeve button with shank. That practically clean from being so close to the surface. I guess I'll hit this area a little bit more. there. Small musket ball. Nice. Teeny weeny. Little flatty. Beautiful. It was m mostly masked by a nail, but uh, pulled the nail out and it cleaned right up. I was gonna say, if you get a chance, you keep making your way that way. 
head to what I'm calling the button wash. Uh, There's a washed out section over there. I pulled like uh -huh. four buttons, I think, so far. Oh, nice. Yeah. 50-51, so the place has been good. But we can't stay here all day. Other things to do, you know? So my last round here, I'm out on the orbit. Definitely coming back. Probably better at uh, after fern season. Yep. Oh, that's a pewter button, I think. Yeah, see how the shank is pulled off. Oh, no USA on it. That's what we always check for. But we'll take it. Good. Let me orbit a little bit more out here by these walls. Beautiful. Thimble. Well, I'm trying to leave and make my way over to Dame. And this keeps happening. Not that it's a bad thing. Convex button. That's a beauty. Trying to make my way through that. Wow. 70-75. Oh. Oh, it's a saddle badge. Look at that. Oh, nice variety over here. All right, again, getting through that. It's uh, uh, some sort of. Relatively modern shaped piece of metal. Exhaust. <laughs> yeah, it looks like exhaust. Nice. All right. Yeah, and the deer flies. Oh, vicious, crazy. Yeah. And they don't care. They're like orbiting satellites. Once they hook on, that's it. Almost took my ear off with my shovel. It's like, ah! Yeah. So we hate to leave, but life things have to be done. You can come back and NT this. This will be great. For sure. Absolutely. Uh, good job on finding this and whoever was here. If somebody was here. They left some things for us. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> thank you. <laughs> so everybody get out. Explore your world. You never know. You may find places like this and find things. So we'll see you soon. Until next time, enjoy your not Thursday. Thursday.